All right, guys, so uh, I'm, I'm sorry, something happened here y me sacó la reunión y creo que todos lo sacó también. <laughs> sorry about that, but thank you so much for coming back. Um, so we are going to go over today or pretty much, nos falta ya como estamos a la mitad. We are just like in the middle of the module. So thank you so much for todavía estar acá, you know, like super ready for this. Eh, y trabajando para, para llegar a, a alcanzar su objetivo, right? That is finishing 2020, like super strong. So, uh, let me go over, let me go over our attendance, okay, as we always do. So, may you please con cameras, help me um, getting your cameras ready. And I'm going to read out your names y me ayudan solamente diciendo me presto, right? So, give me a second. I got okay. So my first person is a uh, Bismarck. Are you here, Bismarck? I don't see him. Bismarck. So I got Claudia Patricia, Edgardo Vladimir. Present. <laughs> Present, teacher. Thank you. Edgardo, right? Yeah. Oh, I see you. Thank you. Uh, Evelyn Carolina. Present. Uh, Aquí está Claudia, teacher. Uh, Claudia Patricia. Sí, present. I got gotcha. you. Okay. Uh, let me go over Evelyn Carolina. Present, teacher. Thank you, Evelyn. Um, Evelyn Mariela. Present. Thank you, Evelyn. And uh, Fatima Elizabeth. Francisco Alexander. Present. Thank you, Francisco. Gerardo Alexis. Okay. Uh, Herman Mejia. Ahí está. Uh, Herzog Rubén. Here. Thank you. Glenda Beatriz. Present. Awesome, thank you. Jorge, Gloria Elizabeth. Okay. Uh, Jorge Alberto. Not here. Uh, Jose Naum. Okay. Carla Marcela. Present. Awesome, thank you. I got uh, Carla Stephanie. Present. Thank you. And uh, Kelvin Miguel. Present. Thank you. Nice to have you, Kelvin. Hello, no, Louis. No. Not yet. Mm, Maria Rene. Present. Thank you, Maria. And uh, I got Nancy, Nancy Carolina. Present. Thank you. Uh, Mirma Ismari. I don't think I see her. Okay. Nelson Alfredo. Roberto Antonio. Present. Thank you, Roberto. And uh, Roberto Betancur.
I see you, you I see you, Roberto. <laughs> Yeah, but, pero no lo escucho. So, that's the only thing. Uh, Sara Elisa. President. Deme un segundito. No sé si es my internet, pero estoy escuchando por ahí. Silvia Ivonne. Present. Thank you. Jessica Odalis. Not yet. En María Angélica. Ok. Ok, ok. Ok, everybody. So, thank you so much for um, getting your camera super ready. We are going to get started with our session today. And uh, actually, vamos a hablar un poquito de ropa. We are going to be talking a little bit about clothing. We are going to work with new vocabulary. Ok. So, um, Comencemos a pensar también como cuáles son nuestros items of clothing, que son los más, the ones that we prefer, ¿ok? Y si los tienen cerca, pues get them, ¿ok? Get your favorite jacket, get your favorite pair of shoes, your favorite blouse, t-shirt, because we are going to be talking about it. Now, um, let me start sharing my screen right here. Give me just a second. Um, okay, give me one second. Hold on. Okay, so in the meantime, my internet is getting stuck. But uh, tell me, guys, talking about clothing, what are some of the clothing items that you remember? ¿Cuáles son algunos nombres eh, específicos como de ropa that we wear? ¿Qué se recuerdan? What do you remember? <laughs> Sneakers. Dress. Okay. Shirt. Jacket. T-shirt. Jacket. T-shirt. Yes. Shoes. Okay. Shirt. Blouse. Blouse. Shirt. Okay. Jeans. Socks. Okay. Okay. Let's do Jeans. something. Let's do something. In the chat, all right. In your Hello. chat, we are going to go over. Eh, this clothing, okay, que aplican solamente para mujeres, okay? So I want everybody to help me, okay? So we men, this is going to be only for women, all right? Eh, los nombres de ropa que solamente aplican como for women, right? So women's clothing, let me write it here. Clothing. ¿Cuáles son algunos artículos que solo son para, para women, right? What are, what are some names? You can use your dictionary, translator, material, whatever you have right there. So I will give you one minute. Yes, blouse, dress, earrings, blouse, a skirt. Okay, good. I like it. I like it. What else? Que solo pican para women. Okay, I see sweater, scarf. Okay. Very good. Mm, dress, okay. Bag, ah, very nice, okay. Dress, okay. Dress. Intentamos no repetir, try not to repeat, right? But you're good. Gloves, okay, okay, that's fine. Okay, now let's change topic and let's go to men. So men, men's clothing. What about some items que aplican solamente para hombres? Tell me what are some of the items that are only for men. Okay. Suit. Ah, okay. A suit. Nice. Mm -hmm. T-shirt. Okay. Tie. Yes, very good. That's okay. We're good. Was. Um, Carla, I'm not quite sure. Oh, I think it's a watch, right? Uh, Carla, I'm not quite sure, but I believe it is a watch. Mm, short. Okay, short. A belt, okay, it's okay. Tell me, what else? Cosas que solo aplican for men, only for men. All right, a tie, a coat, shoes, okay. Incluso los, los zapatos tienen nombres, right? <laughs> and some are kind of interesting. Okay, very good job. Uh -huh. A cup, a hat, all right. Very nice. I like it. You have a lot of vocabulary. Good job, everybody. 
Okay, now let me go ahead and let me show you. Let me start presenting my screen right here. Let me make this a little bit smaller. Mm -hmm. Okay, hold on. Okay, so this is the objective of today's class. In this class, you will learn clothes vocabulary, particularly clothes which you wear for work and for leisure. So, cuando estamos en la casa, when we are at home, we wear different kind of clothing, right? No es la misma que cuando van, for example, when you go to work. So, uh, Talking a little bit about these guys, do me a favor. Please give me an emoji, los que usan uniforme. Give me an emoji, the ones that were, who were a uniform. So like a blouse, a pants or shoes, que son parte del uniforme. Anybody? Nobody. Nobody wears a uniform? Really, guys? Okay. Okay, uh, so seriously, nadie usa uniforme to go to work? Nice, that's good. Okay, uh, I'm impressed. <laughs> I'm impressed because pensé que la mayoría usaba como a uniform o una blusa específica, you know, like pants, a specific pants or something. Okay, but that that is very interesting. So let me read the chat. Give me one sec. Okay. Mm, ay, no logro ver el chat. Que nada se ve chat. Give me one second. Uh, guys, creo que alguien me escribió en el chat, pero no puedo verlo. Así que, please, eh, activate your microphone and tell me, because no, no me está desplegando. It's not displaying. O alguien me lo puede leer. <laughs> Can somebody help me please with the chat? I cannot see it. Yeah. Carla, oh, I only see Carla with the hand up. Any question, Carla? Yo sí uso uniforme. Oh, you do. Mm -hmm. And también logro ver que dice Kelvin. Okay. So, Carla, where do you work? ¿A dónde trabaja Carla? Uso mi forma, pero de estudio, no de trabajo. Oh, ok. Ok, hold on, hold on. <laughs> What do, first, ¿qué estudia? What do you Bye. study? Estoy estudiando bachillerato. Really? Are you in high school? Wow, ok. Ok, pero está estudiando y está trabajando. No, estoy estudiando. Oh, okay. Este año I'm me impressed. Graduó, así que no. este es el otro año. Okay, hold, hold on. Oh, okay. Very interesting because eh, you were able que entró al programa. Okay. De Insafor. I like it. Nice. So, para, para estudiar se usa uniforme. Okay, gotcha. Eh, Kelvin, are you studying as well o para el trabajo usa uniforme? Eh, para el trabajo. Okay. What do you wear? Or what color? What color is the, the shirt? Or the t-shirt? Eh, es... sería? Blue y Blue. pantalón okay. black. Blue and black. Okay. Is it a t-shirt? Es una camiseta. Is it a t-shirt? O es una shirt? O una camisa? Sh camisa, ¿cómo? Shirt. 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 Oh, shirt. So it is a shirt. Okay. So a uh, blue shirt hay, and black pants. Y hay, y hay, y hay alguna diferencia entre manga corta y manga larga o igual? Uh, yes. <laughs> yes. Uh, pero podemos usar la palabra shirt para indicar que es formal. Mm -hmm. So shirt. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. So I got Kelvin and Carla. That's it. All right. Okay. Interesting. Um, so let's take a look at this. This is actually lo de lo que vamos a hablar, right? Uh, in my company, I don't wear like a uniform, so so we are good, you know. Okay, let me go with the next. This one is going to be like a little video with some vocabulary. Les voy a pedir que para este 
se pongamos como a lot of attention, listen to the pronunciation, and uh, eh, vayamos no, tomando nota porque vamos a usarlo. Let's start taking notes of the vocabulary that we, you listen to, okay? So let me play this one, me confirman si lo escuchan. Hi everyone, in this class yes. you'll learn closed vocabulary. Lo escuchan, can you listen? Yes, yes. Sí. yes. Where for work, yes. Yes, teacher. for leisure. Yeah. As you can okay. see on the screen, okay. so clothes let's... which are on the image towards the left hand side are for work, and the ones towards the right hand side are. Hi everyone, in this class you'll learn clothes vocabulary, particularly clothes which you wear for work and for leisure. As you can see on the screen, the clothes which are on the image towards the left hand side are for work, and the ones towards the right hand side are clothes for leisure. Let's practice by listening and repeating the vocabulary. Clothes for work. Shirt. Tie. Belt. Jacket. Pants. Suit. Coat. Shoes. Blouse, scarf, skirt, high heels, raincoat, dress, clothes for leisure, hat, sweater, jeans, gloves, boots, cap, T-shirt, shorts, socks, sneakers, pajamas, swimsuits. Now it's your turn to practice the vocabulary that we just learned. I would like for you to talk about the clothes that you wear for work and the clothes that you wear for leisure. If the clothes are not mentioned here, you should add them. For example, I wear a tie for work. I wear shorts at home. After you do this, please share your work in our discussion forums. Okay, everybody, so we are talking about clothing. We are talking about all the things that we normally wear, all right? So I will give you some minutes and I want you to make your personal list Class of learn. clothing Close items, right? So here we have, for example, a clothes for work. But for example, in my case, I don't wear a scarf, yeah? No sé si alguno usa, por ejemplo, a, a coat, all right? Uh, I don't know if you wear a hat for leisure, okay? When you're in the house, do you wear something like this? Or what is what you normally use, right? So I'm going to give you like two, three minutes. Y hagamos una listita. Let's make a list of the most common clothing items that you use, right? Uh, for example, we have a skirt. Uh, I don't usually wear a skirt. We have suit. I don't usually wear suit, a dress. So, si lo usan, you can make it, you can write it uh, on your list, okay? I'll give you three minutes. Saquemos un pedacito de papel, you know, a pen or a pencil, y creamos nuestro list of items we wear.
No sé si mi internet falla. O es el de la ticha. Yo la escucho, mis, díganme. No, está bien, es que no escuchaba, teacher. Ah, oh, no, no, no. Look, uh, I, I understand. <ríe> Lo que sucede es que les, les pedí que me ayudaran haciendo como una listita de los items de lo que usted normalmente usa, right? The things okay. that you wear. Si usa vestidos, faldas, blusas, um, you know, ambas cosas para trabajar y para estar en la casa. The most common things you wear. Mm -hmm. Ok. So les doy como unos dos minutitos más y me avisan cuando están listos. Ok. Teacher. Thank you. Dígame. You're welcome. How do you say chinas or sandalias? Uh, I'm going to write it in the chat so okay. everybody get uh -huh, part of it. It's called this way. That's flip flops. There you go, flip flops. Thanks, teacher. <laughs> You're welcome. Teacher, uh, can you make the image again, please? Uh, you mean from the video? Yes. Yes. Yes, of course. Give me one second. Thanks. No, I direct a beta, fíjate. Ah, solo una parte. Mira. Thanks, teacher. You're welcome. And uh, Carla, I'm answering your question also in the chat. So you can use this word that is slippers. Okay, everybody, so we are going to join, okay? We are going to go to these, uh, to these rooms 
and we are going to talk to our classmates. ¿Cuáles son los items que nosotros utilizamos más? Eh, I'm having some technical issues, así que me voy a salir y voy a volver a entrar a la meeting. Por si, eh, no estoy segura de si el sistema lo va a sacar, espero que no. Pero si lo saca, please, me ayudan y, y regresan nuevamente, right? You come back, please. So let me send you to these small groups. Give me just one second here. Okay. Okay. Uh, yeah. So give me one second. 